Hey guys, it's Sam. Welcome back to my channel. So today I have a super fun random haul video for you guys. I'm not sure if any of you guys have seen this, but it is ColourPop's birthday, fifth birthday, fourth birthday. I don't even know. I get it all on Instagram and stuff like that, but I don't really pay attention. So anyway, it is their birthday and they are having humongous tons and tons of sales on their website. And they did the sale of the BOGO. Um, what are those things called? I've got a ton of them. I don't know why I didn't just look. Super shock shadows. That's what they're called. I didn't even have to look. So they did the buy one, get one of the super shock shadows. Super, say that five times fast. Super shock shadows. So I picked up a ton of them. I also picked up a couple lipsticks and a couple of their regular eyeshadows as well. So I thought that it would be really fun to really quickly swatch them for you guys, just show you guys what I got. And if you guys are interested in seeing a video where I try all of this stuff actually on my face, let me know. I would be happy to do so. This also is not all of the stuff that I got from ColourPop. But the reason I'm not going to show it all to you is because some of it is for you guys and you will see it when I do my giveaway video. And I also will not be swatching anything in that giveaway video because then you would be pretty much getting used makeup that's had my fingers in it. So that's no fun for anybody. So the first thing that I'm going to talk about is actually in here. So I picked up this little Tarte like Z palette because it was just so cute. I love camo. Um, I've already shown you guys the three shades on the bottom, but the three shades on, on the top row are new to me. So I thought it'd be really fun just to swatch those super quickly first. They came in a set. This was not part of the deal. I just couldn't resist these colors. So this first one is in formation. So that's this like turquoisey one here. You know what I don't have in this room are makeup wipes. Yes, I do. Do you know why? I said I was going to like try it on my face and stuff like that, but this is just as good of a reason to try it as any. Where did it go? I just got, actually I have that too. I just got this simple cleansing makeup wipe in my top box, which should already be on my channel. Just take a look for it. If not, it's coming up soon. So I just got this. So I think I'm going to use that to take my makeup off my fingers today. This will be as true a reason as any to try this out. You guys can see me trying it. And because I find that hand makeup is almost worse to get off than like face makeup is. Don't ask me why. I've also got like tons of eyeliner on my finger, which is not really coming off. I don't know if that's the fault of the wipe or the fault of me. Got it. We're good. Okay. So I'm going to have this here and use that to wipe everything off when I'm done. Anyway, like I said, this first color is formation, this turquoisey color. So we're going to do a little swatchy swatch. It's like this super pretty turquoise. Um, I'm going to do, yeah, we'll just go down here. Super pretty. It did fade a little bit the further I got, but I mean, I think that's just normal. The next one, and probably my favorite one in this group, is in Fault Line. It's like a really pretty bluish kind of purple. This one's super soft, too, because it's got some shimmer in it. Do you guys see that? Super pretty. I don't know when, all of a sudden, that I got super into purple eyeshadow. I know I used to really like purple because... I don't know. You guys tell me. My eyes are green sometimes. I don't really know. Sometimes they're green, sometimes they're blue, sometimes they're gray. But the green, purple is supposed to bring out green eyes. So like for a really long time, I would only use purple shadow. Not that way anymore, obviously, but I think I'm getting back into it. So this one's called Deja Vu. It's like this really pretty. Oh, wow. I thought it was more of a green, but it's almost coming out more yellow. Me. Eh. That one was kind of disappointing, but I think light shades like that kind of are sometimes. So those are the first three things that I got. Obviously, I didn't get the compact from there or the this isn't a compact, the Z palette from there. I got it from Tarte, but it just seemed like a good place to put the shadows because I have nowhere else for them. Now we're going to get into the Super Shock shadows, which I haven't even opened yet because I've been waiting for you guys to do this. Um, some of the colors in here I did get two of because you guys are going to get some. I'm not going to tell you which ones. You're gonna have to wait and be surprised, but I am almost completely done gathering up all my stuff for you guys. So keep an eye out for that. It is probably coming up sooner than later, sooner than I expected at least. So this first color is in I Like You. I guess I can take them out of the box. Like this. So it's kind of like an orangey, orangey kind of yellow mustardy yellow with some shimmer in it. I love super shock shadows. They are so buttery. Look at the shimmer. Ooh. Got like a little bit of a pink, pink shift to it. So we're going to put it here. 
look at that. That's the kind of like, that's not even yellow, it's green, but that's the kind of color I wanted that to be. Super stunning. These shadows are amazing. If you've never tried these, I urge you to do so. They are, it's like drugstore prices, but high end quality products. Like these are only $6 each and they are so good. If you've never tried them before, I cannot urge you enough to try them. The one problem I do have with ColourPop Super Shock shadows, I find you need to put them on with your finger. So brushes aren't required, but is that a good thing or a bad thing? I don't really know. So the next one is in Bubbly and it's like a bubblegum kind of pink with some glitter in it. Looks like that. Ooh, look at it. Oh, that's really pretty. That'd look really pretty with what I have on now on my eyes. Oh yeah. Do you see that? You know what? Because I can. Oh yeah, that's really pretty. Just cause I can, cause I'm already wearing pretty much all pink on my eyes anyway. So that's number two. Number three is the, ooh, this one's got a little crack in it. That's all right. The other thing is when ColourPop comes cracked, I never freak out about it because you can like smooth them over really, really easily. I don't know if that's good or bad. Uh, this one is in the shade Revolution. It's like a bit of a brown, purpley kind of, I don't even know. Looks like that. Oh, look at it. Oh, it's so pretty. I love these two because they don't have a ton of fallout considering that they're glitter shadows. Um, there's basically no fallout, which is awesome. Next one I got is in Zoom Ship. It's like another kind of bright turquoisey blue color. I wonder what it looks like in comparison to the other one. Way better. This one's much bluer. This one's much greener. So pretty. I'm gonna have a rainbow down my arm. Okay, next is one in the shade Whittle. It's like another purple, of course. It's a darker purple though. It's got a little bit of a pink shift to it as well. Ooh, this one was super creamy, I don't know why. Oh my God, do you guys see that? I can't believe how amazing these shadows are. Like why can't other brands put out shadows like these? It's just beyond me. I find that these are some of the best, like in terms of pigmentation, as long as you use your fingers, quality shadows. So this next one is in the shade Snapdragon and it's like another one of those greeny turquoisey ones. This one's more of like a like jade kind of a color. And I think I did a pretty good job of getting some matte and some shimmers. So that one is more similar to that one than that one, but still different enough that I feel okay that I own both. I don't know if that makes it okay. This one, okay, so this one is in the shade Ladybird. I can't get it out of the container. Firebox is so hard. You guys. Look at this. I think this one I didn't get for buy one, get one. I think I got this one in a set with two other ones. Yeah, I did. So I'm going to show those ones as well right now too. So these weren't from the buy one, get one. They came in a set of three, but still look at it. Oh my God. Look at the glitter. I obviously didn't get the green off my finger from the last one. Hold on. Or my finger stained one or the other. These makeup wipes are okay. It's huge, first of all. Smells okay, I don't know. Really, really, it feels really, really moist, but like it's not taking it all off. That also could be because I just keep using the same finger. So let's swatch. I just need you guys to take another minute. Oh my God. Oh my God. I would actually use this as a highlight. How inappropriate is that? I see that that is so pretty Shh. this is what the point of makeup is right just to play and have fun oh my god 
this is amazing. This is probably... I don't know if it's my favorite because I really like these two as well. Mm. So many to choose from. So the next one that came in this set is Superfly. And the reason I can tell that they're a set is because they all have like little butterflies on the containers. So another kind of blue one. This one's a lot darker though. Looks like that. Ooh. That one has a blue, green, purple, I don't even know what shift to it. And it is, it actually looks like the exact same color as my grade eight grad dress. It was like purple taffeta that went blue or vice versa. I can't really remember. But that's what it reminds me of. And the last one in that set of three was Goodbye Butterfly. I'm going to start, I'm going to switch over to my other finger. And this one's kind of like a muted pink. Maybe kind of like a coral. So that's all in there. So the other three that I have were all single ones. So the next one I'm going to do is going to be this one. And this is in Off the Grid. It's like a bit of a maroon red with some sparkle in it. Oh, yeah. See, it's funny because on camera, the shift looks purple, but in real life, it looks brown. So that's that there. I hope you guys can see all this. I don't have enough arm space. I think that's a sign that I bought too many. Oh, wow. Okay, two more. So this next one is in Wild Thoughts. And it's another one in the purple range. It's like a bright fuchsia kind of purple with like magenta glitter in it. So pretty. So pretty. Ooh. That is stunning. So excited to play with these. Let me, I don't remember if I said this earlier, but let me know if you guys want to see a video of me playing with any of this stuff. Or if you guys have like specific colors you want to see me use, that would be fun too. If I kind of like every week let you guys pick, like if I showed you a bunch of stuff, like if I was like, okay, hey, here's all this stuff, you guys pick what I use and you guys kind of like pick out everything. That might be fun to do if you guys are into it. This last one is in special delivery. This is really pretty. It's like a kind of minty, sea foamy green with like blue and silver glitter. I'll never get over how these feel. Look at it. Oh, okay. Ooh. I think I did a good job, you guys, picking colors. And if you like these colors, then wait until you see the ones that I got for you. I think you're going to love them. So that's all of these super shock shadows. <laughs> super shock shadows that I got, all the shadows in general. And the other thing that I picked up is I finally decided that I wanted to try some of the Lux lipsticks. Now these are the original ones. These are not the matte ones, but if you keep an eye out, I did order the MAC Lux, not MAC, the matte Lux lip, lip fault. So that should be coming soon. And I am planning on doing a swatch video with all of those uh, if you guys are interested in seeing it. I'm also thinking that I should probably do an updated MAC lipstick collection because I've achieved, not achieved. What's the word I'm looking for? Attained, obtained, attained, obtained. I've gotten a lot more since the last one I did it. So I picked up three of these. Now they're all kind of like neutrally colors, um, but I'm cool with that. It's always nice to have some nudes. So this first one was in like special edition packaging. I also love the packaging of these. Uh, this one is in Afterglow. The packaging is beautiful. It's like a kind of like rose gold almost tube. And there's little stars on it. Super cute. So like I said, this one is in Afterglow. So I'm gonna put this one here. Ooh, that is so creamy. That is a beautiful color. Oh, I'm really excited to play with that. So that's the first one that I got. This next one is in Mind Trick and the packaging is the same. The one thing I will note is that the bottom of this one just has the color and the bottom of this one has a swatch. So 
This is Mind Trick. It's kind of like a brick red. Really, really pretty though. Cause you know, I need more red lipstick. I don't, I don't have a ton here. Like all of the lip products that I have at this house are in this bag. That's like nothing compared to what I have at home. That stuff's gonna be making its way over here pretty soon though, because I would like to be able to film all my videos over here. And to do that, I need all my makeup. This last one is in Stone Fox. Again, swatch on the bottom. Look at it. Oh, that's beautiful. It's like a perfect light pink. So that is everything that I got from ColourPop. Um, I know this video is super random and super disorganized and I ramble all the time, but uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you guys like seeing haul videos, keep an eye out because there will be more coming soon. I just placed an order with MAC Cosmetics and really excited. I also just placed an order with XO Beauty. That should be here by Wednesday next week. It's Friday now. Keep an eye out for that. I will be definitely swatching everything that I got from there, probably lip swatches as well. We shall see, but I'm so excited for that. So if you like this kind of video, then give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate it. And I will catch you guys next time. Bye.